Byron, please stand up and pay homage. I'm not moving. Making his way to the ring from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 231 pounds, The Miz. He's the greatest man on the planet. He has to put up with Daniel Bryan. He does a great job with that. He's accomplished everything in his career. Reality television star. Yeah, and his ego is his worst enemy. Seriously, show this guy some respect for once in your life. I respect everything The Miz has accomplished inside the ring here at WWE. His personality, on the other hand, leaves a little bit to be desired. Miz has it all, Byron. I think you're just jealous. I really think you're jealous of everything Miz has accomplished in his career. Look, I respect what Miz has accomplished in his career. In fact, you might say one day Miz might be a, a future WWE Hall of Famer. With any luck, Daniel Bryan could follow in his mentor's footsteps and maybe make it to the B-list. Miz asked me to ask you to be quiet throughout his match here tonight. Sure he did. He wants A-list commentary from me and Graves. Uh. And his opponent, from New York, weighing in at 220 pounds, Wade Wilson. Guys, we're getting the night started with an amazing matchup here. You're absolutely right, Cole. In fact, I don't think there's a better way to start this night than with this match right here. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. We're at a crossroads. Neither competitor is backing down here. Watching this match, I can't help but think how much pay-per-views have grown over the years. I mean, remember the ones back in the 1980s, which were great, don't get me wrong, but now they've really grown into such a major spectacle. Oh, what incredible power! Wow, what a vertical suplex! 
You gotta believe this one's over. What you were saying before, Byron, was spot on. WWE pay-per-views today really take over the entire city, and people travel from all over the world just to say they were a part of a WWE pay-per-view. Yeah, I actually met fans from three different countries during breakfast earlier today. All of them were here in town specifically for this WWE pay-per-view. This doesn't look good, Byron. Yeah, this is how people end up getting hurt. Having this pay-per-view here has to be a thrill for these fans. I can tell you that when Backlash came to Washington, D.C. in 2000, which wasn't all that far from me at the time, you couldn't go anywhere without hearing somebody talking about WWE coming to town. And that Backlash 2000 car that Byron brought up earlier might have been the most chaotic main event we've ever seen between The Rock and Triple H. And in the end, it was The Rock defeating the game for the WWE Championship, despite Mr. McMahon stacking the deck against The Rock in a major way. And it's The Miz able to stop the count. Yeah, this early, no chance. Point of the elbow, nailed it. The Miz with a nice reversal. Knocked off his feet. And here he goes. Is he done? Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah, I'm not really sure why he would let him out right there. Oh, man, right to the R. Hyper extend your elbow. Uh-oh, and a suplex. No surprise that the sold-out signs went up. He might have it. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Beautiful technique. Here's his chance to win this. The Miz got the worst end of that stick. Oh, it's not going to be good. This is not going to be Oh, what a brain buster. Oh, nasty. Corey mentioned earlier that the sold-out signs went up fairly quickly for this one. Or as WWE Hall of Famer Gorilla Monsoon might have said, the SRO signs went out early for this one. Oh, man. I don't know if there was an announced pairing more entertaining than Gorilla Monsoon and Bobby Heenan. True legends. Oh, nasty impact. And gentlemen, the Miz may be fading away here. There's a good chance he can't recover from this. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. The tension, the drama. This is electric. Out on the apron. Oh, this oh. is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad. Oh, impactful slam. He wants no part of the outside. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Incoming. Got the shoulders down. Referee's calling for the bell. The match is over. Many would consider this an upset, Byron. Yeah, a hard-fought victory for this superstar, but he definitely earned it. Yeah, look at it. His opponent, sore loser. Yeah, but apparently it backfired. That's what you get for not accepting a loss. And now the celebration can begin.